going on guys? Mark with Extreme Edge coming at you with a review today of the Kershaw Discus. How many of you are a fan of Kershaw? I really do like Kershaw. I've got a couple of their folders, and this is the first fixed blade I've bought off of them. I'm sure I'll get more. Um, so, let's go over this bad boy. You're looking at 9.5 inches in overall length with a 4.6 inch blade, 0.13 thick. Got some nice G10 handles on there, decently textured with a lanyard hole. Feels really good in the hand. I like the I like the contour of it. Feels really decent. Um, the blade is uh, Sandvik 14C28N steel. It is stone washed. Has a flat grind. Uh, a drop point. Very nice. Um, weighs 5.4 ounces and comes with a leather sheath factory. Um, and the leather sheath is not of bad quality. Uh, it's a decent sheath. It looks a lot like, a, you know, the, the old school Buck 19 sheaths. I'm not sure how well they hold up. But I can tell you that it does hold this knife very well. There is, this is zero rattle as to be expected from leather sheath. Um, it holds the knife really well, quiet on the draw. Don't think it'll stab through, it's got a really thick leather bottom. And a decent sized belt capture. Something that you could forget's on your hip. Very nice knife. I believe these guys run about 40, 50 bucks. Really nice knife. Feels really good in the hand. Made out of decent steel too. Sandvik, uh, I've heard good things about it. And this ladies and germs is the Kershaw Diskin. You're on the fence, I'd say pick one up. Feels really good in the hand. So I carried mine for a couple of weeks. Wow. Easy to forget it's on your hip. Very light. Thank you guys for watching, and as always, stay tuned for more videos.